In Tecumseh, Michigan in the early 1930s, Raymond Herrick, a tool and die maker, embodied the spirit of the times. Optimistic, energetic, and innovative. Herrick had no formal education and only modest savings, but he had an idea to apply mass production techniques learned while working with Henry Ford to the assembly of refrigeration compressors. In 1934, Herrick founded Tecumseh Products Company, which would become the world's largest producer of refrigeration compressors. That first year, the company produced 12,500 belt-driven units. In 1938, Tecumseh revolutionized the industry with the first hermetically sealed compressor. This innovation significantly increased appliance longevity and reliability and earned Tecumseh a top reputation. By 1939, the company was producing 160,000 compressors annually. During World War II, thousands of patriotic men and women served their country overseas. Back home, citizens and businesses were called up too. Tecumseh applied its mass production know-how to manufacture record numbers of 40 millimeter shells. After the war, with much of the world in ruins, food preservation equipment was badly needed. Tecumseh shared its knowledge and began working directly with foreign licensees. Post-war desire for refrigerators, freezers, and air conditioning was soaring. In 1947, a Tecumseh compressor powered the first window air conditioning unit. In 1950, Tecumseh produced two million compressors and had sales of $72 million. A few years later, we introduced a compressor for automotive air conditioning. Consumer demand for these products grew exponentially, and by 1954, Tecumseh compressors powered 48% of all cooling appliances. By the mid-50s, sales were $124 million. Air conditioning was no longer considered a luxury, but a necessity. To meet the increasing demand, we implemented a multi-plant, multi-division strategy and expanded our licensee program to increase production and improve responsiveness in all locations. By the early 60s, we'd become America's largest compressor producer, with our units in 70% of all freezers, window air conditioners, non-GM automobile air conditioners, and 30% of all refrigerators. Over the next decade, we made substantial innovations, expanded applications, even established research programs. Tecumseh had become the heart of cooling in America. Amidst soaring energy costs and increasing regulation, Tecumseh redesigned existing families of compressors and introduced new lines with even greater efficiencies. We also continued to provide high-quality jobs to thousands of employees at four domestic plants with production capacity of over 40,000 units per day. In 1987, we released our second rotary compressor design, which provided quieter operation and increased efficiency. Tecumseh continued to grow its international market, and despite fierce competition at home, net income rose to $82 million. With 13,000 employees and revenues of $1 billion, Tecumseh's compressor and condensing unit business was poised to set the pace for progress in the emerging global economy. We turned energy and regulatory challenges into opportunities by developing new versions of high-efficiency scroll compressors. We readily adapted our compressors to work with more environmentally friendly refrigerants. And as the leader in hermetic refrigeration compressors and systems, we always worked closely with our customers to ensure they have the best solutions for their specific needs. Today, we manufacture from four continents and over 15 factories for customers in countries around the globe. We continue to seek alliances and opportunities to carry out our founder's basic philosophy to make the highest quality compressors and keep costs low. As a result, households everywhere enjoy a better quality of life. Tecumseh Products Company the world's largest independent producer of compressors and condensing units for the refrigeration industry. We've built more compressors than anyone in the world. For 75 years, powering products that change the way people work, live, and play.